Warning viewers, subscribers, keep them saints. Let's have some Bible study, shall we? Scriptures. Let's start at Philippians. Philippians 2. All the way down to 2 5, all the way down to 2 15. 2 5. Let this mind be in you, which was also in Christ Jesus, who, being in the form of God, thought it not robbery to be equal with God, but made himself of no reputation and took upon him the form of a servant and was made in the likeness of men. And being found in fashion as a man, he humbled himself and became obedient unto the death, unto death, even the death of the cross. Wherefore God had has Wherefore well, God also had highly exalted him and given him a name which is above every other name. Hallelujah. And that at that name, and at the name of Jesus, every knee should bow of things in heaven and things in earth and things under the earth. And that every tongue shall confess that Jesus Christ is Lord to the glory of God the Father. Wherefore, my beloved, as ye have always obeyed, not as in my presence only, but now much more in my absence, work out your own salvation with fear and with trembling. For it is God with which work it in you both to will and to do of his good pleasure. Amen. Jesus, being in the form of a man, humbled himself. Humbled himself and became a servant. Became a servant. God made manifest in the flesh. Jesus who came to earth to show us, you, me, and everybody else, how to have salvation, how to live a life without sin. I know it's not easy, but we are covered by the blood. We can't be perfect like Jesus was, but he gave us an example. When he came to earth, when God came to earth, he gave us an example of what we must do what we need to do in order to be saved. Look not every man on his own things, but every man also on the things of others. In other words, don't think of yourself. Don't look at yourself and think of yourself and the things you're going through or the things you have been triumphing over or the victory that you have in Jesus or the despair that you had or are having right now. But look on others as well and help, help them. Help them. Reach out to them. Let them know about Jesus. Show them the love of Jesus. Let this mind be in you, which also is in Christ Jesus. Yes. In other words, you have a renewed mind. We go through mind renewal every single day that we wake up in the morning. We have a mind renewal. How so? It's not, ju it's not just that baptism. When we see the transformation, we have a mind renewal because we wake up in the morning with Jesus stayed on our mind and we go out and do work in the kingdom of God for the kingdom of God and with the kingdom of God, which is all the saints, all the disciples of Christ. You know what I'm saying? That's a mind renewal every day because 
We could wake up in the morning and say, I don't want to do this no more. I don't want to go back to the world. I don't want to do the things I used to do. We have a mind renewal because Jesus is with us every day we wake up. We have a mind renewal. Wherefore, my beloved, as ye have always obeyed, not as in my presence only, but now much more in my absence, work out your own salvation with fear and trembling. Everybody has to work out their own salvation. Yes, with fear and trembling. Fear of the Lord is a good thing. The fear of the Lord is a good thing. Amen. For it is God which worketh in you both to will and to do of his good pleasure. And his good pleasure is your his will for your life. That's his good pleasure. That was made that that's what makes God happy. He wants to give him all the glory. He wants all the glory. God shares his glory with no one. Let's get that straight. He shares his glory with no one. Amen. Holding forth the word of life that I may rejoice in the day of Christ, that I have not run in vain, neither labored in vain. Amen. Stay, in, in other words, stay true to the word of God and hold forth the word of life. Hold it forth to everybody. Amen. Not just to yourself, but to everybody. Don't be selfish with Jesus. Hold it for to everybody. So that you and everybody that hears the word of God that comes to Jesus have not run this race in vain or labored in vain. Amen. 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 Y'all stay strong, you heard. But most of all, stay strong in, in Christ. Don't forget to hit the like button. Hit the like button. But remember, there's only one faith. One faith. There's only one faith. One baptism and one God. Love you all, my kingdom saints, viewers, subscribers. Thanks for watching.